off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay says will do i got apples i just texted voice texted while i drove the apple guy um and asked how his apple orchard fared over the winter and spring and summer and if it was ripe enough to pick the apples yet and it's not he needs four more weeks if you are new to my channel, I have a friend that lives in Yakima or has an orchard, an apple orchard in Yakima, and he gets us thousands of pounds of apples and he brings it to our church parking lot and we sell them to all of our friends from around the neighborhood, the community, church, everyone for 50 to 75 cents a pound. Killer deal. And I think the timing is not that great. Four weeks from now is not the best timing for me. I've got a couple things coming up. Um, so we'll see how things go. I do want to make applesauce. It is a full day thing. But I do want to make some. I'm not going to go overboard with it. Hi, welcome to our day, by the way. I just jumped right in with you because <laughs> that message came in right when I pulled the camera out. I do want to make applesauce, but I kind of want to challenge ourselves to finish the applesauce we currently have before I make more and Abby's teeth are pretty sore so I'm going to convince her to use the applesauce I'm also going to use it to have Jason make the waffles with instead of oil I'm going to maybe I haven't made that zucchini bread maybe I'll use some of the applesauce in the zucchini bread in, in place of the oil I'm just going to try and use up what we currently have and then make a new batch and I'm, I maybe only will make like two dozen jars or so I don't know so we, we shall see but I am here I'm at the park I'm going for a walk the sun was out when I left my house I'm over at, at this park is like a it's got a, like a lake effect it's like right um, due south of the lake and so it has like a weird lake effect um, with rain and clouds and stuff so um, I hopefully I don't get rained on it's fine though because I'm I need to shower desperately but I wanted to show you something that I found today I was in my office kind of straightening it up because Ashley every room she enters it gets messed up <laughs> so I had stuff all over the desk and I was straightening things up and I didn't have my camera with me or I would have shown you but um, uh, somehow there was a crossbody bag probably one of the ones I ordered on Amazon last year while I was waiting to try and get this one on order from lug um, it like fell on the floor from underneath my desk and I hadn't seen it for a long time and I was like what is this and I lifted it up and I tossed it back underneath the desk I probably should just donate it because I don't need it but it is the perfect one for like like if Ashley needed it to go to cheer I could maybe like get her to take it but anyway something fell out on the floor and I see what fell out on the floor that I didn't know I had I'm trying to get it ready for you to see. Oh, hang on one second. All right, you ready? Look what I found. <gasps> My last Maui pins. <laughs> Makes me so sad. This one is our official last Maui pin that we got. And then I do have the hand, Shaka. I have it up here, I'll show you, but it's in green. So that's kind of fun that I have it in gold. Um, I don't know if it says, no, it just says Hawaii on that one. And then I do have the little girl. Oh, but she's in a different bikini. <laughs> Let me show you. I should just collect them all. I think they're so fun. Okay, so see how she has a red bikini top and the green hula skirt. Then this one has a ukulele, a green skirt, and a purple top. And then the same, nope, she has a, she has a lay on. And this one here has a little, uh, what do you call it, flower in her hair. So I think I should like, I didn't realize that there was different ones. So I should try and collect as many little hula girls as I can on the next trips, of course. And then here is the other shaka that I have. I have that one in green, aloha, then the shave ice, 
I didn't even realize that these two were different. I've got a little surf um, card there and then the shave ice. And I've got a little, I don't, someone told me what this drink was. I, we don't, we're not, we don't drink alcohol, so I don't know what this one is called. I just think it's really, really cute. And then the Aloha, and then the, um, from the Big Island, the Volcano one from the National Park. This is just what I had in my car. I left some in my other car. But now I gotta figure out how to add these ones on. I gotta figure out. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting a little bit crazy, but I'm just obsessed. I just love having them and seeing them and having them dangle and, and whatever is kind of fun. But I am going to head out and go for my walk. The rain is coming in just under two hours. So I'm going to put away my bag and the camera. I don't know why I'm zipping up the bag because I need to put this camera away. And I'm going to go for a walk. I just got a new book on my audiobook, um, House in the Pines. I think that's what it was called. You saw it. Um, I've been waiting for that book for a long time. So I'm excited to listen to that one, listen to some music, maybe a little TikTok. I'm just going to walk. Now that I have um, my headphones are charged, which speaking of which, I should put my headphones in. I have headphones that are... Why is there only one headphone? Oh, I dropped it. Why am I like this? I dropped it in the middle of the night. And I said, pick it up now or you're going to forget it. Dang it. Well, I can listen to a book with one ear. <laughs> Dang it. And that's like not even my dominant ear. Not that it matters. <sighs> Dang it. I thought I was doing so good this morning. But I am going to walk. That's not going to stop me. And I'm too far away from home to like go back and grab it. So let's go. felt good. I did four miles, almost 10,000 steps, but I'll get the 10,000 in today. I think I'm going to run to Costco after I shower and get cleaned up a bit. Um, we have used that whole big bag of carrots for two batches of uh, the carrot juice and a dinner. Like I made carrots for dinner one night. So I'm going to go get another bag, but I need to look up a few more recipes because Abby doesn't necessarily like the carrot portion of it even though you can't taste the carrot I think she's thrown off by the color and knowing there's carrots in it so I need to look up some more recipes and see if there's more fruit or veggies that I can get at Costco um, because I am enjoying the drink I am drinking it every morning um, before anything else even if I'm intermittent fasting which I'm trying to do and I'm gonna get back to it because I got my injection pens and so it's easier. I don't feel hungry in the morning necessarily, but this morning I wanted a little bit of boost of um, just energy. I wanted to be able to walk as far as I could today without getting hungry at 11, 12 o'clock like I knew I was going to get. And so I did drink it this morning along with my protein milk, the Fair Life milk. Um, so that was really helpful this morning. So I don't necessarily care that I didn't intermittent fast because I started with the vegetable. So, I am going to go home and get cleaned up. It did start raining about 20 minutes early, but it actually kind of felt good. So, I didn't really worry about it. And I was covered in trees, like half of the trail. So, it really didn't make any difference. I was like, oh, it's raining. I should stop. And I'm like, why, why stop? Like, you're already sweaty. You're already dirty. You already need to shower. Why worry about a little bit of a sprinkle? If it had been a downpour, maybe that would have been like a different story. So I'm gonna go home and get cleaned up. So I haven't really felt like filming all day today, partially because I've done nothing. <laughs> I've worked on the computer, um, working on a few things. <sighs> but it's quarter to eight at 7.30, right when I should have been there to pick up Ashley from cheer, I realized that I was late, but it's only a few minutes away, so it's not like, she's never ever done right on time. Let me roll my window. But the problem is that Jason has gotten home in the time being from when I parked my car.
car in the garage and I haven't, we had problems with our two Teslas like thinking we're each other and like, anyway, it's, it's a Tesla problem. So I deactivated my access to his car and gave my key back to him, my card key back to him so that the two accounts weren't linking up to each other. There is a way to do it. We just did it wrong the first time we did it and got annoyed with it. And so we deactivated everything. So I didn't have access to get into Jason's car to move it or take it. And he's parked behind me. And so in my rush, oh my goodness sakes, nothing is working. Um, and I'm not used to driving a car car. I know it's like stupid problems, but um, I'm just like not used to driving it again. And uh, anyway, luckily um, Ashley's two coaches are our friends. Like their kids are Ashley's best friends. <laughs> so she's like, are you coming? She called me and I was like, I'm coming. I couldn't get into a car. <laughs> she's like, oh yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> okay, hopefully they're right here. Literally, like, so easy. There she is. Sorry I'm late, but I'm sure you still had fun. Yeah. Correct? Yeah. And you got compliments on your shirt? Yeah, I got like, where did wearing... you get it from? <laughs> I'm like, Timu or Amazon. I don't know yep. which one. Yeah, Timu. You can get them on Amazon. Yeah. Yeah. Good practice. How's your foot doing? Still hurts. Still hurts? Yeah. Got that sunset. Well, I'm sorry I'm late. And I'm glad you had a good practice. Mm -hmm. We should ice your foot when we get home, right? Right? Yeah. Okay. You're tired. School catching up to you? Yeah. Tomorrow's Friday and then you have a four day weekend. Why? Because it's Labor Day on Monday. You don't have school. And on Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, school Tuesday. It's a three day weekend. Oh, what did I say? Four day. Oh. Three day. Sorry. <laughs> tired. And this glow is like crazy cool. I almost forgot to turn off the car too. <laughs> oh, see? No, but I didn't walk away from the car. I didn't. Do you miss mom's old car? Do you miss this car? Oh, uh, whoa, whoa. I it? have the brake on. I don't know why it's like I like park. my other car. <laughs> really, it's not in park. I can't turn it off and not put it in a park. It automatically goes into park. It's not gonna just turn off and reverse. Okay, so, you try and hold this key. That. And see if that key w works for you. Just, know, can you I just. I don't know how to lock the car now. I have to lock it in order to see if Then it's open works. it and shut it. I have to walk away. Then walk away. All right, it's now gotten really dark. <laughs> Um, yeah, there's nothing in there. All right, we have successfully added me back to his car. Um, added, well, he was on this car. Well, yeah, you were on this car. But we do have one dead card key. Key, key, my car too. Like, each of us have two keys that go to our cars. Every car comes with two keys. So I get one and he gets one for my car. And I he gets one and I get one for his car. But we have one of them that's not connecting. Not opening it, not starting it, not nothing. Which was the problem I had because that was the only one I had available to me when he was gone. But let me tell you what we remembered because we're newbies with these two cars is that he actually could have used his phone to act, unlock the car and allow me access to his car remotely. And I could have started the car and driven it without a key, without his phone, nothing. He, from his walk, he could have, actually could have just driven to you, but like that wouldn't, I mean, I literally could have just used the car. We should have tested it, but you know. It's like valet mode or something. Yeah. Yeah, because you don't want to like give someone your phone or whatever when you're going to valet service. We forgot about that. I could have done it that way. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. But uh, now we have just one car that we've got to figure out. You go shower. Yes. Okay. Also my little flowers. I need to soak in water tomorrow. I think I will end up with a clean sink. Yes, we're doing pretty good on dishes today. Kids are doing their chores on time. Yep, that's an empty, dirty dish dishwasher. I'm gonna put one of these in the freezer for him. You know the trick, bottles or cans, 
to get them to go cold really, really quick. I do this for movie theaters when I take sodas to the theater, but it's actually the way that you can get the soda really cold, really quick. We're gonna do this for dad. I'm gonna get you a root beer cold, okay, babe? Okay, so you wrap it up in wet paper towel and then stick that in the freezer. And it doesn't do anything. Yes, it does. It'll get it cold really, really fast. But that showers. Okay, what do you want? That was just on a wet counter, which is why I've asked you to wait for me okay, until I, I was care. ready to do I know you don't care. You five things. You can just take this. Why can't you just take this? Yeah, Dad made a big deal about copying it. I don't need to copy it. So now we need to find five things that I define Ashley, right? Does it have to fit into a certain bag? Okay. I have two of my cheerbos and a bracelet and a... Can I pick a, maybe a better better photo? Wait, where did the photo go? Right here. Oh, you it. took it out. Oh, I dropped it. Okay, came out to my room to get some alone time. Not that I don't get alone time all day long, but like this one just is a little leech. Um, but I did just get my package from Shaper Mint. Yep, that's what it's called and I'm opening them up. It came with a free bag to wash them in, which I'm gonna do a better job at washing them and drying them manually because I've never had good bras before. <laughs> They've all been from Walmart. Um, not that that's not a good bra, but I just I literally never had a good bra. So this is just a regular one, just regular, because it has like a back closure to it. Um, and then I also got a sports bra as well. I might try them on tonight. I'm obviously not gonna show you guys, but I am excited to see if they work and I don't know, if they feel good.